so in this video we will exploring the crack and the authorization side because we have already covered authentication uh, and we will see that authorization this video if you will see in action if you'll hit the requests for normal authentication they gives us uh, access token if we copy that access token and inside go to the get node posts because it needs that that endpoint needs uh, uh, user authorization as well so if i will request to that first it will gives me unauthorized if we will pass a proper token of authenticated now it will gives me 403 request for bid in because the user did not re request for that because it's permitted with uh, admin roles so how to do for that if you will see inside that and I will log in again with that specific photographer now if you will see to get request with that hopefully it gives us data because that specific endpoint needs either the user have role of photographer or admin if i will pa pass admin hopefully that also works because that specific endpoint needs either admin role or photographer role so that's it if i will pass another role like mm, customer now check with that now the request gives us forbidden because that specific role did not allow to access that at points so let's deep dive to inside the config file to understand the flow of authorization uh, first step is the login which gives us token and refresh token with expiry next step is the endpoints of node post so that post actually inside the validator there is a roles and roles key so here we will pass how many role that specific endpoint needed to allow the users to access i have passed admin and photographer right and the role key i have passed as roles uh, so every time the request goes to hit that endpoint of crack and it first check either the uh, coming roles is photographer or admin if they both uh, match the request will be handled successfully other than that it will throws 403 forbidden request error so that's it hopefully you will get to the uh, flow of authorization as well uh, also uh, the question arises how the crack and knows either the request coming from admin side or from photographer uh, when we going to login and we will pass there the token actually gives us a payload if you will decode that specific token and see here here inside the roles key there is a customer so every time request made crack and D look into the response and in the payload will match inside the roles key because i have passed that roles key would be roles if you will see inside the payload there is a roles because it will hit that specific key inside that will check the role of that specific roles admin or photographer so hopefully it makes sense and you will know how it works